Oh, you killed my parents. I'll show you with the most suffocating blowjob ever captured on video. What the fuck is wrong with these gay people? Oh, those children are so hot. Jeffrey, could you draw a better picture of my dead wife? All women are good for is sucking dick and watching Desperate Housewives. Bitch, I could cut myself just as much as you do. I just have better shit to do, okay? That's not how it... Uh, okay, so what are we getting? I want a CD. And a shirt if they have one. It's one or the other. Why can't we steal both? You don't steal twice in the same trip. The only people here is us and some dad buying Skechers. Who do you think the security guy's gonna have more fun gawking at? He wouldn't look at us. We're like children skipping school. Oh, those children are so hot. How many men do you need to see outed as sex offenders before you start seeing there's a trend? You know what? Pick for me, Nicole. Lead the way. Dude, I've been looking everywhere for you. Since when do you take elective gym? It's the easiest class ever. You just be skinny and get an A. And get sexually harassed by the gym coach. No, he doesn't do that for the seniors. He thinks we're old enough to tell our parents or something. Ew, I wouldn't tell my parents at any age. Yeah, that's like way too embarrassing. Imagine telling your mom a 50-year-old man wants to eat a Lunchable out of your cleavage. Exactly. Parents and sex are two entirely different worlds. Unless you're in Arkansas. The only way I tell is for a pity dinner at Red Lobster. Hi, Bar. So what do you want? Oh yeah, I have a project I need help with. Nicole, that MySpace girl isn't even fun to bully anymore. No, not that. Another project. The supplies, right? Yeah, for... You brought me here to cook crack? Yeah, what else is baking soda for? I don't know, baking? Dude, why are you freaking out? We've had drugs before. Yeah, perks and robo, not go to jail drugs. Okay, just let me borrow your stuff. I need the community service hours. What does making crack do for the community? Nothing. Selling crack's another story. We live in cul-de-sacs. Who's gonna buy this? I'm not selling it here. Oh my god, this is gonna ruin my parents' serving spoon. Just buy another one. It's from Tiffany! Why would you bring a Tiffany serving spoon to make crack? You never told me what it was for! Look, calm down. This will take like an hour, right? Oh my god, yeah. I want to try coke for real, but I feel like I'd kill someone on it. Oh. I just don't want to OD, but good to know your potential. Alright, the whole room smells like burnt plastic, so I think we made enough today. My parents are gonna be so mad when they see this spoon. Just leave it here. It's better lost than ruined. That's true. Okay, I gotta go to PG County now. Can you give me a ride? I'm not driving to PG County, Nicole. What if my car gets stolen? Oh, so you'll freebase crack but won't drive through a black neighborhood? What are you, Ronald Reagan? I helped you with your community service project. You won't guilt me into anything. Okay, just drive me to the Franconia station. I'll take the metro. Fine, but I'm not driving you back. No problem. I'll have plenty for a cab when I'm done. Hey, what's up? Hey, what you got? You wanna buy some crack? Whoa! <laughs> Damn, he did sound like a cop, huh? Hey, Mo. What you need? What you got? I got rocks, bricks, white Legos. Uh, uh, how much? Hundred for the baggie. Uh, uh, here you go. Thanks. Oh, one more thing. What? Could you sign my community service hour sheet? I'll give you an extra rock. Uh, yeah, okay. Yeah, just any fake name, it's fine. I pee. Hundred bucks in a two-hour signature. I think this is gonna work out. Cool. Well, I mean, friends kind of have a lot of definitions to it. Is there a definition where you blow your brains out with a shotgun while I sit and watch? <laughs> what the fuck? Why would you do that? What else are friends for? So, are, are you waiting for somebody? Yeah, and she wouldn't want to fuck you either. Bro, you're acting wild. How can you even say something like that? Hey, sorry, I got held up in math. Jekka, would you fuck Crispin? Ew, no! See, no one wants to fuck you. You guys are just... Man, you guys are wild. Fuck off and leave! <laughs> okay, I'll see you around, guys. What the fuck are you talking to him for? Dude, I don't know, I was alone and he came up to me. You know they get brave when we're alone? What was the holdup? I was flirting with my teacher. For business or pleasure? He's 50, what do you think? I was trying to get an A minus. Cool, or? Yeah, that's what the hour sheet's for. After tonight, I'll probably be all done. Cool, cool. Yeah, I thought you got out to prison or some shit. Right? But no, I'm too white and pretty to go to jail. Hey, the fuck, bitch, you wild saying that shit. You wild, you anything. What, do you want me to lie? Yeah, yeah, I guess. Uh-huh. Well, I got packs to move, so if you could... Nah, yeah, I'll see you some other time with it. Damn, Crocs gotta be awesome if it has this many repeat customers. They wanna act like you wanna be in jail, like you didn't know the consequence. No shit I knew, but it's either suffer out there or suffer in here. And when you get out, it's even more bullshit. P.O., ankle monitor, drug tests, felony record. It's almost like you had less problems on the inside. The system's educational for everyone but the prisoner. This is a maze and we're the rats. But most days you'd rather die than get to the finish. Now all I think about is dying. 
I guess 50 was right. Right about what? It's get rich or die trying. I did what I had to. You're white. What? You're white, Nicole! You didn't have to do anything! That's what you think. What I know is we live in cul-de-sacs, and you don't have to sell crack when you live in a cul-de-sac! I didn't even totally mean financially. Like, my parents were mean to me and shit. It, like, makes you make bad decisions. You sold crack to a pregnant woman because your mom was mean to you? Yeah, sorta. So all you did was take your little problems and turn them into someone else's bigger problems. They weren't little to me. You better turn Islamic and pray the judge agrees with that. Can white people be is Girls are kind of high maintenance. Girls play mind games I can't figure out. And so the month we had together made me realize something else. Realize what? I realize that guys turn me off, but girls make me want to fucking kill myself. You bullied a gay girl into being straight. So, Nicole, what brought you to the straight club anyway? Some drama, don't worry about it. She's just being shy. Some dyke bitch told everyone Nicole was homophobic because she didn't want to date her. What the fuck is wrong with these gay people? Not blaming all of them. Yeah, that's what they always say, but these freaks won't stop till society's underwater. We should publicly execute those weirdos. Now that's what I expected to hear at a straight club. What's her address, Nicole? Let's show that bitch a lesson. Whoa, chill out, I don't know it. Don't hold out on us. Tell me where she lives or I'm gonna choke slam you into the sugar cube castle. I told you I didn't know her fucking address. Kyla, Kyla, calm down! This is way over the top. I don't get it, coach. I thought this was the straight club. I know, but you're being messy. Besides, I'm a teacher. I'll just look up a file and get the address that way. Great thinking, coach. Get her address for what? Just gonna teach her and her family a little lesson in humility. Come on, straight club. First a student files, then a drive down 95 where the gas is cheap. Down 95? Wouldn't that take forever? I'm not gonna burn her house down with expensive gas. Oh, hell yeah! Let's go, boys. Finally, reparations! I'm hating these homos. I wonder if I'll get blamed for this, too. Who could help me out of this shit? I give you guys a scenario, and you play it out and get feedback afterwards. Oh, uh, yeah, it makes sense. So the scene is you're a newlywed husband and wife in 1949, and the wife wants to know what the war was like. What if he doesn't know what the war was like? It was 1949. Everybody was just getting out of the war, or at least knew someone, right? Okay, so, so we go now? Yeah, uh, action. Hey, you seem kind of upset. Is there a thing you want to talk about? Nah, I'm good. Oh, well, do you want to hear about the war? No. Wait, wait. Megan said you can never say no for improv. It just makes it go nowhere. That was the plan. Well, I guess don't do that. All right, let's try this again. Hey, wife, something on your mind? Yeah, uh, there's something I've been wanting to say lately. Oh, what's that? The N-word. Why would you want to say that? It's 1949, isn't it? Don't we usually say the N-word? Oh, may maybe, yeah. The N-word is probably my favorite thing to just scream in public with no repercussions. 1949 is a great year, for us anyway. Uh-huh, I'm glad you're happy. Yeah. Oh, do you see that? See what? That different colored family pulling up in a Lincoln. You want to do the honors? What are the honors? Calling them the N-word, duh. Why would I do that? It's 1949, why wouldn't you? Oh, right, um... Is there anything else you want to talk about? Yeah, do you want to join the KKK? It's normal right now. No? Dude, what the fuck? Megan! What's the matter? Crispin said no during the improv. What the hell, Crispin? We went over this. No, but- Another no! I told you to get that word out of your vocabulary if you're gonna do this exercise. Yeah, but the situation got kinda- The situation doesn't matter. It's improv. No matter what, you never use that N-word. If you do it again, I have the power to fail you for the quarter. Alright, so, uh, resume scene. But yeah, honey, should we sign up for the 1949 KKK initiation? N okay. Great to hear. By the way, could you tell me about the war? Oh, and use the N-word as much as possible when describing it. And scene. Oh, alright. So how'd we do? Uh, I'm gonna have a talk with Megan. This is starting to sound like a red tube video. Ew, I'm not gonna fuck him. Okay, just checking, because every video on there sounds exactly like that. Like what? Like... Oh, you killed my parents. I'll show you with the most suffocating blowjob ever captured on video. Dude, how much RedTube do you watch? 
Don't worry about it. And so, that's why I wasn't super broken up when my wife killed herself. Any questions? Jeffrey. Yeah, what's our science lab gonna be about today? I meant questions about my wife killing herself. Oh, sorry, no. So for today's lab, we'll be identifying which element is which based on its mass and volume. Get into your groups while I grab the supplies. Oh, my partner's out today. Damn, that sucks. Are you gonna be okay? Uh, yeah, I guess, but it's gonna be bullshit effort doing it alone. I could partner with you if you want. Really? I thought you hated this class. Well, we're both in drama, so it might help to know each other if we're gonna act. I thought you hated that class, too. I'm warming up to it. But, Nicole, I thought we were lab partners. Shut up! Shut the fuck up! Go away! Oh. Wasn't that kind of harsh? Yesterday, he was telling me about how he kills dogs in his backyard. I can't work with someone like that. Huh. Okay, I guess that was justified. Sit with me. Emily, do you know where to buy whippets without getting carded? Uh, no, sorry. I don't even do whippets. Damn, because you really look like a girl who does whippets. Oh my god, thank you. A little weird she took that as a compliment. Oh, I almost forgot. Yeah, how's it going with Megan's boyfriend? I'm making some pretty good progress. And so far, I got ten... 11 pictures of his dick so far. God damn, he's desperate. Yeah, but I'm trying to get one with his face in it too so I can prove it's him. Yeah, or else that could be anyone's dick. But what if he's just tricking you with a picture of someone else? Why would a guy carry around 11 angles of someone else's erection? He could be gay. He's definitely not gay. No gay guy would skeet in his mom's jewelry box for me. Uh, why would he do that in his mom's jewelry box? I told him it would really turn me on, and within 90 seconds, he sent a picture of it. You want to see? Ugh. Yes. Look at this. Jesus Christ, it's like filled up. Pearl necklace on a pearl necklace. What's that thing in the bottom corner? That's the head. Ew, uncircumcised! That's disgusting! Get it away! You thought he'd send 11 pics of a photogenic dick? I'm gonna throw up! Uncircumcised men should fucking kill themselves! Maybe that's why you want to include his face. You mean when you came in your mom's jewelry box? Did anyone need my help over here? Yeah, actually, for the- No, we're fine. Just thinking. Okay. Jeffrey, could you draw a better picture of my dead wife? Yeah, the jewelry box? Yeah. Among others. That was really hot, by the way. You really thought so? I I had another one like that, but I forgot to send it. Another jewelry box? No, it was on my brother's Uno collection. Uh, Like- Like Uno the restaurant? No, Uno the card game. Oh. How can you have a collection of Uno? Like all the different versions. NFL Uno, Batman Uno, Simpsons Uno. And you just put them all together and blew a fat load on them? Yeah. And while I was doing it, I was thinking about you and... Oh God, listen to me. What's wrong? We're just having a normal conversation. I didn't think a guy who cheats on his girlfriend and photographs his dick would have a strong relationship with Jesus, I guess. Oh yeah, no, I've seen it. I would so get off to your pictures if it wasn't for my faith in God. Like, okay, thanks. How'd you even get that far with a guy so religious? That's when I found out. Like, what the fuck do I say? I didn't know Jesus was the escrow in titty pics. Who even is Jesus anymore anyway? Someone pedophiles find to say they're not pedophiles anymore? You think our counselor will ever find Jesus? Yeah, if Jesus is a 15-year-old girl wearing Juicy Couture. High hopes. So, I guess I'll just go to a really awkward drama class tomorrow. How are you going to tell him no? You just distract him. Hey, so I can't go to church, but you know what I do want to do? You know what I want to do really fucking badly? That was cool. How do you do that? Dude, 90% of dirty talk is just rhetorical questions. Literally how? It's just some ugly guy writing shit on himself. No, not the visual. Just the raw control felt really awesome. Nicole, that's what rapists say, just so you know. I mean, I guess, but like, I'm a girl. What am I going to do? Guys will fly off the handle for barely anything. Yeah, guys will not get a Lego set when they're five and 30 years later molest kids over it. Exactly. Now on to the next step. Sup, bitches. Who invited you? Me, motherfucker. You guys want to go to the fair with me this weekend? The fair? Yeah, with like games and shit. Is it 1920? Why would I go to the fair? Yeah, we have internet and Xanax. Fuck the fair. What's so bad about old stuff? 1920 is a cool year. You would like a year where rape was legal. Rape was not legal in 1920. In practice, it was. God, shut up. There's cool shit to do there. They don't even card you. Honestly, it's your loss. Hey, whoa, what's going on? Show up the yelling. Leave me alone, bro. Don't be a bitch. Don't make me fight you. Dude, what? Don't be lame right now. 
Why are you still here? Me? No, both of you. I was just trying to, like, he, he was kind of going at you. We're not going to fuck either of you. Oh, whatever then. Yeah, no, um... I literally do that every week. Speaking of every week, are you still watching Real Housewives Atlanta? Nah, I got tired of it. Is it bad now? No, just every commercial on Bravo is like, guess which celebrity's gay? We got him this time. It's annoying. Or the gay channel, it's kind of homophobic. Unfortunately, the deadline for your character drawings has come. I will now walk around to provide feedback and collect your artwork. Jekka? Oh, here. Care to explain the piece to me? It's me and Ryan Sheckler at the Warp Tour. Ryan Sheckler? Yeah, bitch, he's sexy. That's an unlockable character in Tony Hawk. He's not even real. You are really fucking stupid. Watch the language, Nicole. Fuck, sorry. I mean, shit, sorry. I mean, whatever. Now, I'm very interested to see yours. Are you sure? You worked hard on it. Let's share it with the class. If you say so. This is... What is this? Oh, it's a picture of you killing yourself while your wife blows the UPS man. <laughs> what? How? Where'd you get this information? Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Was it FedEx? This isn't funny, Nicole. I think it's pretty funny. Yo, what's up? I, I got the shit. Where the fuck were you? Places? I got shit to do. I'm not some drug addict like you. They're not for me. They're for my boyfriend. You have a boyfriend? I don't even want to sell this to you anymore. Are you kidding me? I got a hundred for the bottle right here. One ten. You said a hundred on MySpace, asshole. Yeah, but you didn't say you had a boyfriend. Fuck me. Okay, one ten. Here. Thanks. And, and let me know when you're single. Let me know when you're not. What? Have fun, Nicole. I'll try. Gotta get home before Mind of Mencia comes on. Kyler, can I have a pill? I don't have a boyfriend. Panhandling pills? What are you, homeless? Uh, no. Oh, good. Yeah, you can have one, because I fucking hate the homeless. Okay. Seriously, like a lot of politicians just say that, but I actually want homeless people exterminated off the planet. Yeah, but that's an opinion. Like, the only way they could contribute to our society is by jumping into meat grinders so we have something to feed farm animals. Give me the fucking pill! Whoa, fine. Are you like an addict? You could say that. Sweet, yeah. Drug addict girls are hot because they're really easy to control. Jesus Christ. What? Oh, uh, I think Mind of Mencia is starting soon. Oh, you're right. I, I gotta go. Walk off. I gotta reply to this. Dude, can you just act like a hot bitch for once? But I'm not a hot bitch. No, I... Your, um, your glasses are cute. Just cute, though. Did I say cute? I meant hot. Like, sex for free hot. I don't know. I feel kind of nerdy wearing them, but contacts hurt my eyes. Nerdy? No, they're, like, really distinctive in a hot way. You could, like, be in Playboy with a quadratic formula tramp stamp. Tramp stamp? Like the back tattoo? Yeah, dudes could study it while hitting you doggy and shit. I'm allergic to dogs. Christ, whatever. Karen, do you see what I'm saying? You're a hot bitch. Act like one. Well, hold on. What's your textbook there? It's for government. Why? Can I borrow that real quick? Sure. I'll be right back. What the fuck? I should do it. Why'd you ask what subject it is if you were just gonna throw it out a window? Huh. I don't know. Wait, but I broke a window. Isn't that delinquent behavior? You had your reasons, but this is an intricate conversation we'll need to have later. But what if I just did it for fun? Like, no terrorism or feminism or anything? Well, that would be different now, wouldn't it? Okay, then I made the feminism shit up. Just give me the regular trouble. You're not getting sent to remedial classes. No, seriously, I hate women. Nice try, Nicole. I I'm not messing around. All women are good for is sucking dick and watching Desperate Housewives. Out of my office. I need a little help with a paper. Paper. Since when the fuck do you care about turning in a good paper? Since I got an idea to fuck over a teacher with it, Miss Ames wants us to do a paper on modern poetry and hates rap music. So, you think she's racist? I don't follow. I know she's racist, and I want to write something where she shows her whole ass over it. Nicole, if you write about rap music being good, you're just going to get an F, which won't prove shit because all your other papers get Fs. No, 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 no. I'm going to write a paper that agrees with her. And if she agrees with it back, it's going to get her fired. Yeah, but you're going to write the racist paper she agrees with. I'm a kid. What do I know? Then how could I possibly help you with this? Do you want to ask my dad about Katrina refugees? Well, no, so you read books and shit. Is there, like, a really racist book I could just plagiarize? Uh, I have the English version of Mein Kampf if you want to borrow it. Why do you have the Hitler book in your backpack? They assign parts of it for AP history. 
bitch, you pop pills and fuck on the first date. Why are you in AP history? Cause maybe I wanna fuck on the third date one day? Literally for who? Ryan Sheckler, obviously. And he's not gonna marry some dumb blonde hoe, I know that. But a smart blonde hoe? That's where the alimony is. By the time I graduate, I'll know three different languages, so I'll be set to impress when I see him at the X Games. You only take French. Giving head isn't a third language. It is if you're good at it. Take the book. Reading Mein Kampf alone at the diner. Let's see you guys turn this into a conversation starter. Hence, today I believe that I am acting in accordance with the will of the almighty creator by defending myself against the Jew. Okay, let's cross out Jew and replace that with rappers. What else? The ignorance of the broad masses about the inner nature of the Jew. Hip hop artists, if you could even call them that. This paper's gonna be so fucking easy. Nicole, I didn't know you were in AP history. Huh? No, I'm not in AP history. Then why are you reading Mein Kampf? I'm racist now. Oh, all right. Man, Ari's cool about anything. Oh, hey, hey, what's up? What the fuck do you want? What? No, nothing. Just saw you reading and was like, wow, she looks real smart like that. Is this like a usual thing for you? Reading in public? Sure. Yeah, yeah. So what you reading there? Mein Kampf. Oh, yeah, I've heard of that. It's supposed to be really interesting, right? Uh-huh. What do you think about it, like, specifically? I think it has, uh, like, really good themes in a story. Big fan of the message in Mein Kampf? Yeah, you could say that. What's your favorite part? What's yours? Oh, uh, like the middle. Did you read it in English or German? Was it in German first or something? Yeah, it's the only German book America cares about. Oh, that means it's super good, then. I should recommend it to a friend, right? Right. So can I sit with you? Mein Kampf is the Nazi book. Oh, cool. I didn't know that. So can I sit with you? What is wrong with her? Why? Are you sure you're not just hallucinating off those meds? No, Seroquel doesn't make you hallucinate during the day. I'm going to kill myself. God, this isn't even that much weed. You want to roll some? No, marijuana is a baby drug. You can't even die smoking it. Okay, we'll just sell it. Oh, look at this. Is this your next jump off, Jeffrey? Um, okay? What's going on? Oh, he didn't tell you? Then again, he didn't tell us either. Yeah, Jeffrey loves telling girls they're the only one. Then he blocks your number after you're left with herpes. Fuck the herpes. You got me pregnant, Jeffrey. What? what, what? Is this true? You told me you're a virgin, Jeffrey. Oh, so we just never existed to you? But they're making all this up. I don't understand. I am a virgin. Would a virgin say there's 493 Pokemon before going down on me? 493? You told me that exact Pokemon number yesterday. Were you cheating on me? No, I don't even know them. Not only will he cheat on you, he's also really Christian. Yeah, he'll tell you he's pro-life while finishing. Oh, no. You're not believing them, are you? I... I need a minute. I need you to pay for my treatment. And you better pay for this baby, Jeffrey. <laughs> I gotta go! What the? Karen, no! Come back! I feel... <sighs> better. Yeah, I don't even feel like selling this quad anymore. Oh, that reminds me. The idea for the oral presentation. Oh god, that's tomorrow, isn't it? No, no, don't worry. I got all the supplies ready. It's just flashcards, right? Not exactly. So you know how I want to, like, screw up Miss Ames? Yeah, for sure. And we don't even really, like, have a plan of our high school, right? Like, honestly, what are we going to do? No, you're right. So I thought it'd be really badass if we show her the real state of modern poetry. Real suffering. Not some bumper sticker bullshit. Dude, I'm down for it. What do we do? Okay. We go to the front of class, say a few words, and then we'll swallow this pill mixture I made and- A mixture of what? So I started saving all my Seroquel instead of flushing it, and then I mixed it with stuff my boyfriend gave me, and then I bought Percocet off Kyler. Well, hold up. You're gonna OD in front of the class? We're gonna OD, cause death is fucking poetry. And when Miss Ames sees that, she's gonna shut her ass up about poetry for the rest of her life. Uh, are you sure about that? Are you backing out? 
well, it's just a little... This is a two-person gang here, Nicole. Don't make me jump your ass out. No, no, I'm cool. Shut the fuck up! I said I'm cool with it. No, not you. I was hearing voices again. Voices where? Like, in my head. They always tell me I'm wrong about something. The psychiatrists might disagree, but have you considered listening to the voices in your head? Whatever. Look, are you down or what? Totally. Anything you want. Awesome. You're awesome. I love you, Nicole. Like, I really fucking love you. If you told me to kill someone, I'd do it. I wouldn't tell the cops shit. What if I told you to not kill someone? Like yourself? <laughs> Nicole, I know you're worried, but we're gonna do it together. It's gonna be okay. We got a big day tomorrow. Let's get some sleep. We sure do. You're not gonna kiss me goodnight? Oh my god. Mwah. Thanks. I love you. Yeah. Are you gonna say it back? Okay, now I do want to kill myself. Think about it. Why would a man want to be a public school teacher other than to have sex with the kids? Th that makes no sense. Okay, if you're a man, right? You have way more job options, less annoying jobs, but teaching pays like total shit. Yeah? Uh -huh. So why would a guy go to college for one of the worst paying jobs and one of the only jobs where a man can be around minors five days a week? Because they like teaching? Then why not a university where they actually pay? Uh, I don't know. Not all male teachers are ugly. It's not like they don't have options. Exactly. Sex with a regular bitch won't do it for him because they want don't tell your parents ass. It's totally fucked up, I know. Nicole, you need SSRIs really bad. She was at a party and somebody walked in on her right as a guy skeeted on her face. What the hell? Why wouldn't she lock the door? I think she wants to get caught. Uh, what do you think, Karen? What's skeeted? Huh? Huh. Skeeted on? What does that mean? Um, so it's like when a boy- Dude, it's not that hard. It just means to compliment something. Excuse me. Well, why don't you just say compliment? It's just slang. Skeet, skeeting, skeeted on. Like how Jekka skeeted on my collage? Oh my god. Exactly. I'm skeeting all over your collage right now. It's awesome. Thanks. Yeah, it took so long to put together. Yeah, you're pretty cool. Hang out with me and Jekka more and guys are going to be skeeting all over you. You really think guys would want to skeet on me? Yeah, with your glasses on and everything. You're unbelievable. What's wrong, Jekka? Oh, um, nothing. Just... nothing. By the way, I like your outfit. Did anyone skeet on you today? No, I'm pretty elusive. She's just being humble, Karen. Jekka really likes it when three or four guys skeet on her at once. Wow, that many? I've always thought you were really pretty, so it makes sense. Thanks. Yeah, and she never wants it to stop. Not until she's gagging on compliments. Okay, so me and Nicole need to go now, but good luck with your collage, Karen. No problem. I'll see you guys later sometime. Uh, hold on, guys. I forgot my big gulp jug. Hey, do you know how Kyler passed out? Is he a friend of yours? Not really. Um, he's like my boyfriend. Sorry, girls, but we can only divulge medical information with family members. Family? He's my brother. You said he was your boyfriend. Can he not be both? He shouldn't be both. Will you stop judging her Swedish heritage and just tell us? So, essentially, his body shut down to the point where his lungs are barely functioning. If we didn't get him sooner, he could have lost a lot of brain cells. I didn't know five was a lot. But do you know exactly what caused it? We won't know anything until we get him to the hospital for a toxicology report. Since you're family, would you like to ride along in the ambulance with us? This must be very hard for you. Nah, it's okay. I don't care that much. Um, okay, so if that's it, I have very pressing matters to tend to. Where is my big gulp jug? Are they just gonna wait for him to get that? Yeah, I see Kyler in the back there. They're not driving off. You don't think they can, like, stomach pump the pills and find fingerprints on them, right? No way. I don't think so. Cool. Yeah, I don't care if he dies. I just don't want to be held responsible. Yeah, same. Do you think we should go to class now so this doesn't look suspicious? Why does it hit so fast when you start it? Fuck. Doesn't Vicodin always hit like that? I never tried it. No, it takes like an hour when you take it like a pill. Wow. Prescriptions are just dope on layaway. A line of it does a little at first, but then just creeps up fast. Here, try it. Oh my god, I'm scared. Is my nose gonna bleed? Only if you do it like a million times. <laughs> what the fuck? How does your mom function like this? She doesn't. What if she needs these later? It's easy to get more. She can make an appointment and pay like two bucks for a whole bottle. They won't cut her off or anything? Yeah, that's the one perk to being old. If you want enough drugs to shut off your emotions, they won't assume you'll try to OD or anything. Yeah, they said that when I wanted sleeping pills. It's so bullshit. Like, even if you wanted to do that, it's like... Like... Like, none of their business... Shit, it's really hitting now. Oh yeah, I feel it too. It's like 
Percocet, but not as good. You can say that about any painkiller. You want to watch Mythbusters now? I am nowhere near fucked up enough to watch Mythbusters. We might have something left to fix that. Why the fuck do you want to watch Mythbusters so bad? Uh, I don't know. It's the only thing on when I skip. Uh, okay, give me something good. You want to try a mystery pill? I'm not even looking at the label, but I'll crush it up. Mystery pill? What if it hurts me? Dude, you're viked up. You're good. All right, fuck it. Line it up. <laughs> Is it good? Oh my god. Oh my god. What did I do? I don't feel anything. Really? She always has the strongest shit. What if it's just a Claritin or something? No, my mom barely has allergies. Let me read the label. Metroprolol. Generic for beta lock. Beta lock? It should say what it's for, right? It says, use for high blood pressure or tightness of chest. You had me do a line of beta blocker? Oh god, it's hitting. There's a name for it? How'd you know that? A chemistry teacher told us about it last year. Miss that class. That was the last pill, too. My mom must take a lot of these. I'm like deflating in my own body. How long does your mom to always need these? We don't really talk about that. She just comes home and yells at me. I would yell at you, too. Why the fuck didn't you tell me it was a beta blocker? I think you're missing the point of a mystery pill. I took it with Vicodin, Nicole. Call 911. Dude, you're gonna be fine. Worst case scenario, you pass out. Why do I feel like a guy's told me that before? I'm gonna call your mom and tell her sorry she'll never have grandkids. What? No, don't kick me down there. I don't need to, because the more Mario trivia you know, the less women want to fuck you. And you know a whole lot of Mario trivia, don't you, Jeffrey? M more so the canon of the Mushroom Kingdom. You are gonna fuck so many kids in your 30s. How do video games and anime make me a kid like her, huh? That's like asking how does heroin make you a drug addict. I'm getting real tired of you picking on me. It won't be so fun when the shoe's on the other foot. Are you threatening me? Are you threatening me in Skechers? Well, um, uh... I'll take the gun you're saving for the cheerleaders and shoot you in the fucking face with it! Dude, we'll look the other way on your minor fetish and get you a pizza, okay? Does he have a major fetish? No, his major fetish is a minor fetish. So what's the fetish? I told you, a minor fetish. I know it's a minor fetish. What's the fetish for? Minors. Like guys that did coal? Not those minors. So shitty baseball players? What? No! Then what's the fetish? Um... He's into girls under the age of 18. Oh, that's not good. Why are we getting him pizza? Dude, where is he? The grease is gonna get solid. Hello? What if he's in the shower? Good one. Were there this many scuffs on the carpet before we left? Holy shit, what happened? Wait, his laptop's open out here. Is that usual? Uh, oh god, not with 20 porn tabs open. Literally 20? 1, 2, 3, 16. Who needs that much porn at once? People with more game systems than exes. Every tab is a different fetish site, too. Like what? Uh, jigglyjihadist.com, belowtheborderlatinas.net, asiangirldynasty.org. I didn't think your brother would be into such racially charged porn. I didn't think my brother would be into women at all. Wait. Oh god, what? After those, there's a bunch of milfdaycare.com, kidnappedbabysitters.html, barelylegal.gov, and almostlegal.co.jp? I've heard of barely legal. What the hell is- Holy fuck, too young! What is she, Asian? Oh god, that kind of too young! The Russian roulette of internet history! Are we in the system now? Oh, you killed my parents. I'll show you with the most suffocating blowjob ever captured on video. Oh, those children are so hot.